Welcome back to 30 Minute Valheim with Cody. I am Cody. I came over here and I got some stuff and I need my cultivator. And then the timer ran out and then the timer looked at me. So yes, the name of the game right now is uh, Upping My Plains Survival Chances. Cultivating foods that are delicious and nutritional. As well as growing flax, which will lead to superior fibers. And all sorts of crap like that. I'm going to put a little bit more wheat and a little more flax in the ground over here. See how that helps the world. If that helps the world achieve peace, then great. If uh, it just moves us a little bit in the direction of peace, you know, that's also great. Either way, I'm sure we can all agree that I helped us achieve world peace. Through playing video games. Therefore, playing video games has never been a waste of my time. Certainly nothing else better I could be doing with this time. And I don't know what you're talking about, Dad. <laughs> Alright, don't go too far. Don't want to waste any with this critical exponential buildup juncture. Get some of this... Uh, Get some of this flax in the ground. What am I doing? There we go. Someone's having fun out there. They don't see me though. I don't think farming's gonna get much attention, is it? Oh, I'm just a farmer. Don't mind me, definitely not a violent Viking hellbent on destroying your towns. Oh no. Oh boy, that flax is too close. I did not want that. I did not want to mess with my flax. I only got so much flax. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come on. So once I take those weed out of the ground, I'm not going to put anything else back there. Give that flax some room to grow. So that's Black Forest. So what's this? Black Forest. Plains. Black Forest. Plains. Alright, so these are growing, right? Nope. Can't grow, can't grow. Can't grow. Healthy. Healthy. Alright, so it looks like we're finding the boundary right here. Which is at an angle to there. Okay. Well, that's the boundary of this farm. Let's see how far we can go. I think we can go there. We'll find out in a sec. Okay. That cleared that one out. I did not clear that one out. So it looks like I got a couple of wasted flax. Oh, good. That's healthy now. Okay. Alright, so yeah, I don't want to continue to try to build in this direction, so let's take care of that. Boundary here. Let's see. Healthy, healthy. Can't grow in this environment. Healthy. Okay. Alright, so. I'm be here. This one and this one. Okay. Set this down somewhere where I can keep it 
clear what's going on. Alright, so that is my boundary of my plains farm. Not a lot of space to work with here. That one true. That one true. So let's see. Alright. Cool. Alright, I don't think I know what to do there. What are you guys doing? Hello. Chicken legs. Hmm. Alright, so sure, let's uh go ahead and prepare the space. A little bit more. Kind of making a little more space here for my farm to extend to. I guess making it relatively flat for that. Guess I'm sure this is all planes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that like to get wood next. I think I'm going to go with Black Forest because I kind of like to get a mix of hardwood and soft. Alright. I don't want to get it too low. Let's see. Okay, yeah. Sure. Space here. I'm right up against the ocean. Kind of like that. I like this spot. Let's see. And then, kind of uphill from here, I can imagine having a pit for my uh, locks to fall into. So I can train them. here. I'm liking that. Alright, let's see a little bit. Um, I'm going to cut a little bit for a second, so let's go back and get the uh, equipment for that. Come back and build extensions to my farm. Uh, hold on to that wheat. Good time to pass 10 hours in a day. I think it's going to be sleeping time and then farming for wood time. Back over there in the black forest right near the plains. That's a good choice to me. So we got back home before we go. Might as well take a little core wood. Drop a little stone off. Drop these off. Well, I guess I'll maybe lights later. Repair 
time. Keep those weapons sharp. Really do need a constant monitor. Uh, I just need a second monitor. I'm just trying to figure out. Like, I don't want to go over budget and go crazy with too big of a monitor. And also have to kind of do more upgrades. But man, those wide 55 inches look sweet. Um, but that would make me have to get another arm for home. Because the one I got now wouldn't support those side by side. And if I got a wide enough monitor, I guess I could always settle for having half the monitor be the game, or two-thirds of the monitor be the game, and something on the side, not just doing full screen, but... Something about playing any game in windowed mode always makes me a little apprehensive. Like it's it's, it's, it's going to be subpar. I don't know if I'm right, it's just my feeling. So I could get a a bit larger monitor with maybe a little curvature to it to replace the one I've got now and use the one I've got now as the secondary. Or the cheapest thing I could do it is be to get a really smaller, just cheap monitor. Um, and postpone the decision of getting a much larger monitor till later. And that might be more reasonable. You know, I don't know. It's all just whatever. It's all just whatever. It's all just whatever. Don't you agree? Can we go to bed now? Yeah. We can go to bed now. Yeah, I do want to keep that off planes area for now. Until I build a more sophisticated dock or whatever. So when I'm getting boats in and out, I'm not dealing with birds. In Furlands. 162 days into my time in this Valheim. The one thing I forgot was to grab the Elder as it's tree chopping time. I'm going to pop back over there. I think that will help me a little. Achieve more less time. Oh, and if I come home, I'm also going to be looking at my onions. Eh, not yet, but maybe by the end of this day, the onions are ready. Twelve hours from now, maybe the end of this video, uh, I don't know. Something in that, something in that realm. What, did someone say getting wood? Can I help by grabbing one piece of wood? Aw, damn, that's really hard. I think you're a helpful person. I don't care what your mom says about you. All right, we got our uh, elder on hand. It's in the Plains 1, which is essentially Black Forest 11. Get a little bit away from the planes. I don't really want to be fighting fuelings and skeeters right now. Got my eye on that hardwood. I think all of them fall in the valley here. Why not? Let's just put woods in this little water. Just sounds fun to me for some reason. I just want to cut all the pines that are around here and just have them all fall down in there in the water. Oh, you're not falling in the right water, though. <laughs> not the ocean. I know you guys are going to want to come play. That's fine, because I can use great orb eyes as well. Plus, it's fun when you get hit by the tree. Wasn't there a shaman? A shaman go. There's a shaman. Taking the sweet shaman time. Oh, look at all these dwarfs. Keep coming, guys. You missed me. I kind of 
I love this. Tree chopping. Tree dwarf chopping. Go hand in hand. I don't feel so bored now. Hey. Blueberries. I don't want to fall on you. Keep on chopping. Get about halfway into my elder on cutting trees down and use the rest of the elder for cutting them in twain. Look at you, one star gray dwarf shaman seem to matter how one star you are, does it? No, it doesn't. My sword's pretty good at slicing shamans at this point. Full of trees. Look at that. Yeah, I guess that was my halfway on Elder and got one more tree I want to chop here. Alright. So let's clean up. My goodness. Hehehe. <laughs> These are serious business, y'all. So much stuff out here now. My way backwards here. these. What are these? That stacks of wood's what I need. Okay. You guys are making me forget my mission here. More choppy choppy. Let's focus gather. Come back and get stuff. Come on. Having a gray dwarf eyes for a little bit. Lots of wood, lots of wood. It's one I like. It's what I like to see. So much wood. Every chop's making more wood. Big pile of wood and gray dwarf eyes and stuff. Stump haters, don't look. Just don't watch, you know. I'm not gonna like this. I'm leaving all them stumps for now, at least. There's a lot of Valheim. I don't have to look at all of it all the time. Like they're playing baseball with each other. They're certainly not harming me in any way. Oof. Grey Dwarfs, you're the real mosquito. You guys helping? Thanks. <laughs> I 
Alright, this has been a nice wood choppy chop day. Alright, later fellas. I'll be back. If you want to come hang out, just come over here. I'll give you a tour of my knife. Very good, very good. Casually walking over. Yeah, I know. Come on over. Do, 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 do. It's like walking a tourist into a little criminal act over here. Yes. Okay, I'll go ahead and make another workbench here. Just continue my stuff without that interruption. I wonder where you went. Hear ya, I hear ya. Question is, do you hear me? Alright. Looking good so far. Continuing this uh, same pattern just a little bit further. Let's see how flat this land is. It looks pretty good. Certainly looks fine to me. Bring it on around. Yes, and the same pattern applies here. Stake wall on a hardwood surface. For the discreet farmer. fit. Okay, we got more farm now. Certainly do more. Only need so much at a time though. Love it. All right, so also now, go ahead and uh, fill in these bottoms. We certainly have plenty of wood. I don't know if this makes much of a difference, but it can't hurt. Ah, okay. So cool. Got all that laid out. Let's dump some of this stuff off. Just here for now. Right, grab a bunch of the stuff I left in the ravine. It's all choppity chop, just needs to be carried over. Vacuum cleaner time. Look at that already. And of course, more little fellas running away from the spawn. Oh, I don't like the spawner. Oh, the spawner's scary. Please, please help me. Please help me, Mr. Viking. Okay. This way to the gift shop exit. Shop. 
I see you. Little monkey arms. Chicken legs. Stop it. Stop hitting my little, pretty little fence. Get back. Finish this part of the structure, and then it looks like I'd like to extend it out to the bay a little bit. Kind of start a little block. Just continuing to secure a nice, plain st overall structure. Looks like that just wants this. Kind of hard to get in there. That's working. Yay! This one's a little weird because it's behind there. Should give me the angle. There it is. Tip. And a couple of these. Plug up these holes. That's what I'm looking for on the most part there. Let's go ahead and also go up a little bit. Just lessen the chance of a mosquito coming out and ruining my day. And also, the reason I cut down a lot of that sweet, sweet wood closer and it might be easier. Woo! Sometimes it's just rough to get right in there in that corner. Sun's in my eyes. Took me a while to actually figure out what activates that. That was an annoying time period. Let's see. Can I do it? Yes. That's what I was wanting earlier when I envisioned this. I like the little pattern in the walls. Don't you feel safe already? What the heck is going on here? Oh, I'm out of wood, so it's, uh, it's confusing. Yeah, I do think those floors help him not see me. I think if I see their feet, they see my feet. Long day. Got a minute ahead and a half left here. I'll be finishing up, I guess, uh, next episode. Just going to get stuff that I left around here. Let's see if I can hoover up all the rest of it right at the end here. Satisfying slicing kind of sound. Are you scared? Huh. All right, all but one piece. Picked up. <coughs> Why'd you get your cooties on me? Kind of wish it didn't have that flicker artifact, but you know. You can't have everything in the world that you want. That'd just be too easy. whacking at that door. I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. Okay. A little annoying. Definitely don't want you guys scrambling around here on this side of my base. And that's it for now. See you later.